friends in this particular video we will be discussing about relational operator so it is very simple we all know relations so these are the fundamental relational operators like greater than less than this is important this is comparison means it is to check out whether the values are equal or not so whenever we need to check that two values are equal or one value is to be compared with other variable so we need to use the comparison or the equal to variable so two time equals to we will be writing that means a comparison to be done not equals to there is a combination of not and equals to so it is not equals to then greater than equals to it might be greater than or equals to then this is less than equals to so value might be less than or equals to okay so this will return true when a is greater than b this will return true when a is less than b this will return true when a and b both are same this will return true when a is not equals to b this will return true when a is either greater than or equals to b and this will return true when a is either less than or equals to b so these are relational operator it is just to check out what is the relation between two sort of values or variables now we'll be taking example of it that these are considered to be binary expressions now relational operators are considered as binary expressions why binary because see in any relation when you say a greater than b now if you are checking whether a greater than b or not so there is only two possibilities that statement is either true or false okay so any relational operator results into true or false it means either it is 1 or 0 true means 1 false means 0 so we can say that since it is giving only 0 and 1 as an output we can say these relational operators are known as binary expression now you check out here we have written 10 greater than 5 so it will check whether 10 is greater than 5 if this condition is true it means if the value 10 is greater than 5 so here it is true 10 is greater than 5 so it returns me 1 another example 0 less than minus 5 so 0 less than 5 we can ask like this is 0 less than minus 5 so we say no 0 is not less than minus 5 so this is false false means Zero, so that's why it is zero. Then is twelve and forty-three are same. So we what we'll say we'll say no. So that's why it returns zero. Is ten not equals to hundred? So correct. Ten is not equals to hundred. So that's why it returns true. Means one minus ten greater than equals to zero. So minus ten is not either greater than or equals to 1 so that it returns 0 0 less than equals to 0 so 0 is not greater than but 0 is equals to 0 so that it returns me 1 so in all the cases you have seen that it either returns 1 or it returns 0 so that we can say that this is binary sort of expression so binary expressions are to check the relation between two sort of variables and values So I hope you understood thank you for watching the video